Apple has just released the first public beta of iOS 26, giving users an early look at what's to come in the next major update. But before jumping in, it's important to understand what a beta version really means. Since this isn't the final release, there could be bugs, battery drain issues, or unexpected glitches. Features you see now might look very different, or even disappear, by the time the full version launches this fall. One of the most noticeable updates is the new liquid glass interface. Apple has given the entire UI a major visual refresh. You'll spot changes in the tab bar, control center, and especially on the lock screen. There's a striking new 3D effect around photos that makes the clock appear to morph and float in space. On the home screen, users can now try out new widget configurations and even tweak how their app icons look. Apple has also added subtle, realistic glass-like effects that bend light and distort edges just slightly, making the whole interface feel more dynamic and alive. It's this kind of attention to detail that Apple fans often say sets the company apart from Android devices, which sometimes try to replicate the look without nailing the feel. Moving beyond design, CarPlay has also received a fresh batch of updates. There's now a new widget view that you can fully customize from your iPhone, including third-party widgets. Another big improvement comes to the phone app, which now includes a smarter built-in call screener. When an unknown call comes in, it can answer on your behalf, ask the caller to state their purpose, and then filter it for you, cutting down on spam and telemarketing calls. In terms of new software, iOS 26 introduces two brand new apps. First is Preview, which focuses on handling PDFs and other documents. It keeps the interface minimal unless you're actively working with a file. The second is the Games app, a central hub for all your gaming activity. It helps you track what you and your friends are playing, suggests new titles. As new games are released, this app is expected to evolve, so it's worth checking back regularly. AirPods users aren't left out either. By heading into settings and enabling the beta under the AirPods section, users with supported models like AirPods Pro or AirPods 4 can try out upcoming features early. These include better quality microphone recordings, low battery charging reminders, and even the ability to control your iPhone's camera through your AirPods. One standout feature is auto-pause detection when you fall asleep, which makes AirPods especially useful for travelers or late-night listeners. To wrap things up, Apple fans are encouraged to explore other beta updates like CarPlay, Television, OS 26, and the broader Apple intelligence experience. Apple is actively taking feedback this time, so much so that it reversed changes to the Photos app after user complaints. So don't hesitate to report bugs or share your thoughts. And of course, if you're enjoying the deep dive into iOS 26, don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment, and be part of our family. See you in the next video.